What's up YouTube, it's your boy EpiJS here, back in our video, and I am going to do a one hour of Car killing Karask on Old School RuneScape. I've always wanted to do this, you know, I've, I've watched a bunch of Dicers, EVScape, you know, Mr. No Sleep, you know, a bunch of them people that do that do uh, these type of videos, and, you know, I just want to do it myself, so this video is inspired by them people. So, um, I'll show you my skills. Got 96 range. I am killing them with range. And there's my armor and, you know, teleport. I know I could change this out for, like, a ring of, uh, like an archer's ring, but I use in the ring of wealth for a teleport and, um, to pick the coins up. And,. You know, killing Karask, it would be better if I had, you know, a seed box, box a herb, uh, a herb sack, and a bunch of things like that. But, you know, I don't have those things, so if you're like me, don't have those things, you still can make pretty good money on this. And, um, all that's really what, what that I would recommend is bringing a chisel, some fire runes, and a draining staff, unless you got a uh, fairy tale part 2 complete. And then you don't need the Draymond staff. But only requirement is that you have, I think, 72 Slayer. No, uh, 70 Slayer. So that is the only requirement to kill these things. So if you have 70 Slayer, you have a pretty good you know, combat stat. So you can definitely kill these. And a fairy ring, I think, is a JR. That's for uh, the Slayer Cave. That's where they are located at. So I am going ahead and. And also, if you had, uh, what is this, like 80 agility? I think right here for the shortcut, it will speed up your yeah, 81 agility. I only got the 62 one agility. You don't need to bring any range in potions unless you're like lower range and you're doing this in range, but you it's really not necessary. I'm not bringing any range in potions. I used to bring them, but I'm 96 range and that's pretty high. I think I started killing these things just because I really like this method. It's really AFKable and whatnot like that, so. Uh, so yeah, uh. I started killing these, you know, like I was saying, level 80, and I used to bring range and potions, but I mean, I'm 96, I can kill them pretty, pretty quick. And you do need to use broad bolts. You can use the aim assist ones, but I use the normal ones, or a leaf bladed weapon. I know it would be better for me to bring like a book of law, I think, but I don't have that quest done. So, if you have all that stuff, bring the, you know, your best in slot gear, you know best range gear and whatnot, but yeah right here they are located here if you're on a slayer task you can do that up here if you're not I am gonna hop world I'm going am gonna run over here but I am gonna hop worlds right here is this uh, safe spot I like there is one more I think over here but I really don't like that one, so I am going to hop worlds, because I don't like taking other people's worlds. Um, and if you have any other ideas for what you want me to see kill, I will do it. I will gladly do it. You know. If you want me to do, you know, uh, gargoyles or whatnot, I will do those. Man, these places are populated. A bunch of people must be like killing Kurhask. Oh, yeah, there's someone's there. See these these persons probably on a slayer task most likely. Oh that's right, four streets out. Um if I can find a world to hop to. I I found a world, no one's here, I don't think. So, uh, let, let the hour begin. As you can see, there is a, another guy there. The only reason I didn't switch world is because, uh, he was low level, so you can do that, you know. 
the higher level dudes, um, uh, you you might want to switch roll because if you're both high level, you will uh, eventually kill all the Karaska and there will be some downtime. But that dude was somewhat low level, so I didn't worry about switching worlds. So yeah, uh, and I uh, really didn't get to use my chisel that much because it didn't have that many drops, like uh, gem drops and whatnot, but usually it would have more, and also you could get, be getting more kills an hour if you were higher level, but I was not higher level, um, so yeah. And uh, um, the only things you really want to high elk is, you know, the rune items, the adamant items, uh, and, you know, you want to pick up everything as you can. So if you go up to the herb sack, you can pick up more. And uh, if you don't, you can uh, just pick up the more valuable herbs. Uh, so, yeah, but, you know better range armor, better, better melee armor. I would recommend doing this as, you know, a ranger because it's just a lo whole lot more profit you will bring in because you ain't gonna use, you know, prayer or, you know, food or in, whatnot like that. So, yeah. Um, I'm excited to make the next video. I don't know what that's gonna be. But, um, Alright, we can probably get one more kill in. Uh, this is why I would, I would like to have... Wait, do I have chrome seeds? No, I don't. This is why I really w recommend getting the herb sack before you come and do this. You get a lot of herbs in, especially if you're going to stay here more than an hour. So, like, if I do ever do, like, a 10-hour version of this, I'm definitely going to get the herb sack. And, actually, I can... Uh... This is why I brought the chisel. I figured I would get more gems, but so no, I'm gonna drop this and I am going to get this other emerald. Not the broad bolt. And chisel this out. Okay, there we go. Um Alright, well that's one hour. Let's go back to the GE and uh, sell this and see how much money we have made in one hour. Here's all the loot that I got. I got I killed 93 Kurask and it said I got 400k. Now we're gonna see actually how much I made. There's there's 155. Okay, so let's uh. You know, I am going to high elk this. Uh, usually, I would high elk it, but I just wanted to keep it. But I am high elking that. So high elk anything that you can get more money if you high elk it. Okay, so uh, chrome seeds. Oh, that's probably from when I sold it last time. And I know you could get more if you just set it there overnight, but I ain't, ain't no one got time for that. Good thing when you're killing Karas, a bunch of them, when a bunch of what they drop, they sell pretty quick because they're like in constant demand. As I say that, nothing's selling. <laughs> it probably would be better if I did clean these uh, these herbs up, because you probably would get a little more money. So, but I'm not going to do this.
So in total, I made 486k from one hour killing Karas. I'd say it's a pretty good money maker, um, especially because it's kind of like that mid level. And my count is that mid level. I really ain't got that good of armor. I mean, I got 96 range, but I ain't got I only got a dragon crossbow and whatnot like that. So pretty good money maker. Uh, let me go ahead and put this in the bank. Yeah, see, I only got a stack of 22 mil now. But, you know, I'll catch you guys on the next RuneScape video. You know, next money maker. So, peace.